Ooh. Yo, welcome to Feeding Time. I am the big guy, Ryback. Your hostess with the mostest. Your hostess that needs more information. I need more information. And those shirts are available on Teespring, guys, in the Ryback TV link. Today, today we're going to do, we got a busy day getting ready to get fucking jacked. And uh, at the old Feed Me More Fitness in Vegas. And uh, there's a car driving by. They probably wonder. I found a little tree in this parking lot. Parked with a little shade. Because these iPhones, it's not even, it's not hot here yet. They overheat here in Vegas. So the, the damn, these iPhone, the, 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 the iPhone 11 heats up even quicker than the other ones. I can't imagine in the summer, I'm going to have to put my dash um, cover or my uh, window sun visor deal dealio up fuck i can't think of things but today guys i'm doing a healthy meal before i go train arms usually i would do my protein shake but it's my cheat meal day this isn't my cheat meal i'm doing a starbucks black coffee which it could be a little warmer but it's it's always a running a risk there on the two ice cubes i've told you and uh, i got a Lacroix, the asshole water the um piece of shit I needed to bring something that this is the old, um, what flavor is this? Pineapple strawberry. And today I am doing a spinach feta uh, egg white wrap from Starbucks. And uh, I may have two of them because I need more information. I'm a big guy. So I'm gonna dive into these guys. And I got my loser food tray here. I know some of you are interested in me creating loser food trays, and I'm not against anything. I'm coming out with my own hot sauce as well, which I'm going to think it's going to be under the Feed Me More brand, because Feed Me More is the brand name, and obviously I have Feed Me More Nutrition, and I plan on, I have a long list of things that I want to do. Um, but the uh, we'll see. I, I will see about food trays. You never know if this show you guys get me to a million subscribers and the feeding time is you know a thing maybe i'll come out with some loser food trays for you otherwise because guys i've made a mistake before as well as things have gone for me i'll just tell you guys full disclosure i tried early on because when i wrote my motivational book wake up it's feeding time i thought it would be awesome to get custom feed me more goals feed me more goal boards for people i didn't realize though the problem with goal boards is shipping Shipping these big ass gold boards is very expensive. So I had, oh fuck, I think I got a thousand of them. Had them in, in fucking storage and these things, these motherfuckers. Don't get me wrong, we sold some. Ugh, talk about a failure though. Huge, huge, huge. I, I don't think, I think I loaded them up and dropped them off at a, one of the donation centers here. Yeah, I did. I uh, that's because I couldn't remember. I, I didn't want to throw them away because I was like, no, there's definitely someone will take these, and they're just whiteboards. But they had like five things to write your things, and I got a few of them at home. But man, that fucking failed. Shut the fuck up and eat the food. Okay, put that up. Hmm. The loser doing a food review, ma'am. Keep driving. Bitch. Guys, whenever I say stuff like that, I'm joking. If you've ever seen me in real interviews, some of you, I get it. This is entertainment. So you get some of me when, when I'm talking positive, and then you get other times where I'm just trying to be entertaining because if I just sat here and, and just ate food and wasn't entertaining, nobody would fucking watch well, you're not entertaining anyway. Well, why the fuck are you watching? Who's messaging me? I'm sitting outside of a Sierra Gold bar. A Nevada-style tavern. I tell you. I All I've been thinking... I really... I live such a good life right now. If I wanted to devote a whole day like, just to get day drunk and just sit at the bar, I, I would Uber and maybe have a few friends meet me. Just drink all fucking day. 
I'm talking shit-faced beer after beer, shots, carried out, carried out by my friends, and that's the only reason why they're there, to carry me out. Just fucked up. Drinking for free because the bartender was a big Ryback fan. It doesn't get any better than that. I got to say, I love this vegetarian diet. I really think if you look at me, I go back, I look at photos of me when I was like 31, 32, I go, I look the fucking same. Granted, I looked old back then. Well, pretty happy. I feel like I've, stem cells have rejuvenated me. I've been between 296, 298. Fucking jacked, like I said earlier. I don't understand why there's so many cars driving around. This is an empty parking lot. There's somebody parked in front of the tanning bed, too. Guaranteed that's the tanning bed owner. The tanning. It's his tanning bed, so that's fine. I would do the same. I thought about buying a tanning bed for my house many years ago. But then I was like, I was like, I'm only going to use it once or twice a week. But then, I don't know. There, I was going to get a really good one. A really good one. And, but I, I just, I don't tan anymore. I tan outside naked in my hot tub. And the neighbors, they can't see. You got the bubbles and all that shit in there. And if they can, I don't really give a fuck at this point. Um, real sun's so much better for you. I put some shades on to protect my eyes. And, uh, yeah. Oh, man. just feta cheese, spinach, and egg whites. Very simple. Mm. Mm. Another car pulling up about three spots down. It looks like a loser too. He's definitely doing a fucking food review. Looks like a pizza delivery driver, but where is he walking into? Smoking. That's bad for you. Where is he going? There's no essential businesses open right now. Motherfucker. He's walking around smoking that little vape. I'm judging you. I forgive myself for judging you. Gabrielle Bernstein's working with me. Mm, we're all judgmental. We gotta fucking stop. But seriously, fuck you. Mm, that was like a pizza. There's no napkins! Starbucks got me again. It's my fault. They didn't give me a bag. I should have seen there were no napkins. What fucking stupid? I'm going straight home. I can wipe my hands on my fucking clothes. I'm working out at my own fucking gym. Not like anything's open for me to get seen. So that was the uh, Starbucks uh, spinach uh, fetid, 
spinach, uh, feta, feta, egg white, cage-free egg white wraps. I really like those. Um, I'm giving them, I'm giving those 3.8 out of five stars, guys. And the reason for that is everything was great with them. I thought if, if there was maybe, and I like these because they're really healthy, so I think this is a great go-to for healthy eating, uh, and I, I really, really, really enjoyed these. I really, I can't give everything fucking five stars as much as I want to because I was so happy during that meal. Um, they always say every meal is my best meal because that's the meal I'm in the moment, And uh, but if there was some sort of maybe low-fat, some sort of low-calorie sauce on that. I think it would really, really, and I don't know, I don't know what that, I don't know, I, you know, I want it be against a little bit of low-fat mayo on it, I want it, I want it, I want it, I want it even non-fat mayo, just a little something, just a little something, I think it would really enhance that, I don't know, maybe even a little, maybe a little, little mayo ketchup mix, fancy sauce, a little fancy sauce on that would really go a long ways, fuck, that's it. Fancy sauce. That's Starbucks fancy sauce. Fancy sauce. And so, anyways, 3.8 stars. The two, we got the one thumb up, and we're gonna go right there, right there today, guys. Coffee. Um, I'm gonna heat it up in the microwave when I get home, because I'm going home with that. If I was driving across town or something, I'd be a little pissed off, because it's not as hot as I would want it to be. Because I don't want it to be too hot, but I don't want it to be cold. It's a real fucking asshole over here. Like, like they're going to be able to guess. I, You know, the, the the coffee's piping hot all the time. That's why the two ice cubes is, is key. But the employees get a little, they, they hear two, and I think they think they're hooking me up by giving me three or four, uh, you know? And then they don't understand this is a fine fucking line when it comes to the ice cubes. You just want to cool it off just enough to still be hot if you throw it on someone's face in a panic. But fucking... Not so fucking cold that you can't enjoy it. You want to sip it. You don't want to take gulps of it because it's gone before you know it. And you're fucking wired. You got to sip that shit, guys. Okay? Anyways, let's be good human beings, guys. Let's remember, no matter what's going on in the world, no matter what's going on, things are going to happen out of our control sometimes. The one thing we can't control is our reaction. I want you to control your reaction. We're not always going to get the reaction right. But we have a choice to make that choice right later. With that, I leave you. Happy Sunday. Get hungry. Stay hungry. Feed me more. Yo, thank you guys for watching Ryback TV. If you could check out my Shooting Blanks Wrestling Report every Monday on all podcast platforms, Conversation with the Big Guy Ryback every Thursday morning on all podcast platforms, and Feed Me More Nutrition, my personal supplement line, available on feedmemore.com and Amazon. Save 10% with discount code YouTube10 and save stupid. Why couldn't you? Almost had it. I almost had the whole video done in one take. <sighs> New customers, you can save 20% with discount code NEWCUSTOMER on feedmemore.com. Get hungry, stay hungry, feed me more.